Hey guys, welcome to the tutorial on how to install Radiance 5 to make your lights look brighter and much better in GTA 5. Uh, so just a first quick disclaimer, you will need Renoir installed. Uh, make sure you know which one is for your PC. If you're a 32-bit or a 64-bit, uh, you have to have Renoir installed. Um, so after that, there's two things you need. You need Radiance 5. Um, I'll put a link to it in the description. You can just literally Google Radi Radiance 5. Um, for this, I'll go ahead and delete mine, uh, and I'll do it with you guys, because I know it's helpful when in tutorials the person actually does it. Um, so I will go through the whole step with you guys um, and show you. So you're going to come here to Radiance 5. You're going to hit download this file. It's not going to pop up, something like that. Um, you're going to want to download the most recent version. So for at the time of this video, it's version 1.8. Go ahead and hit download. You're going to go ahead and let that download over here. Once it's done, open it, and you can get rid of that red browser. Next thing you're going to need is your 5M application data. If you don't already have your uh, snail folder pulled out separately, you can just right click on your 5M, uh, and there will be a um, option here that says show folder location, and it's going to be filled with 5M single player, 5M, and your application data. So you want to open up your 5M application data. You're going to go to citizen common data and you're going to leave it there you're then going to come over to radiance 5 open that up you're going to go to visual settings and you're going to take the bright folder and you're just going to drag and drop that's all you got to do now sometimes radiance 5 will break um, which will be a little frustrating and you will need to reinstall it when you do you will not want to use the same file you downloaded you can tell this is the 11th time i've downloaded this what you're going to want to do is come in exactly as I did in the beginning of this video. You're going to come in to your 5M application data, citizen common data, and you're going to take that bright folder and you're going to delete it. You're then going to come back, you're going to go on Google, and you are going to just type in Radiance 5, and you are going to just do the whole step over again. So I'm going to go into uh, the dull server super quick, and uh, without Radiance 5, you guys can see what it looks like. And then I'll go ahead and install it one more time, and you guys can see the difference. Alrighty, guys, we are now in the server. I'm just going to go ahead and spawn a car real quick. Remember, this is without Radiance 5. Uh, we'll just do a Taurus uh, for shits and giggles. Uh, we'll throw the rant light bar. We'll throw everything on, so that way you can see what it's like with everything on. And this is probably how your game already looks like, and this is not how you want it to look like. We'll just throw a bunch of crap on. Good. Good enough. So you can barely see anything. It is as dim as a motherfucker. Um, if you do like these cars and you're not in Dole and you're just seeing this video and you want to apply, there's the website. <laughs> little self promo. Um, so we're going to go ahead, exit the server, and we're going to go ahead and um, take care of that. So uh, go back to my screen. We're going to pull 5M out of the way. And we're going to download this file. Remember, every time you go to replace and redo your Radiance 5, you have to re-download the file again. Uh, you can go back and delete the file afterwards um, so you don't have so many copies. I just personally am too lazy to care. Um, but you can't use the same file. It will not work. So come back to your 5M application data. You're going to go Citizen, Common, Data. You're going to close, Radiance, visual settings you can use very bright I personally use bright um, but you can test both just drag over bright close and close and then you go right back into your 5m um, this works for any server uh, not just the dull server so we'll go back in the server now alrighty guys we are back in game we are gonna go ahead and spawn the Taurus again just throw a bunch of the extras on. The more lights, the better for the example. Doesn't really matter what's on there. Okay. And lights, camera, actions. Looks so much better. Um, obviously, during nighttime, you can see the lights either way. Um, again, if the lights are still too dim for you, you can try out that very bright option. Again, just depends on the server you're in. Obviously, if you're in Dole, um, Dole RP, it, it really is preference. Um, I usually run with the bright. These cars lights are a little bit dimmer so I might throw on the very bright. 
Um, so we'll go ahead and put the very bright setting on right now, come back in game, and we'll test it out. Alrighty guys, and we are back in for a final time. So let's go ahead and get that Taurus out. We have the very bright setting on now. Um, so you guys will get to see what that setting looks like, just so you guys know what um, is good for you and your preference in your game. Again, every car is different, um, so some vehicles have naturally brighter lights than others. So that's the very bright setting. Looks the same to me. Um, again, every car is different. It's up to your personal preference. Um, and yeah. So hopefully that guy, that uh, tutorial helps you guys out uh, with getting your lights brighter and not looking like they were in the first time we came in the server where they uh, were very dim. You couldn't see them at all. Um, if you just want to take a quick look at night, it does also change your other color settings as well. Um, so just be aware of that um, if you don't want everything else to be super bright. So we'll just change it to nighttime and you guys can see what these lights look like in the dark. kind of get an idea. So this is midnight. Looks pretty good to me. Um, we'll just go ahead and spawn a charger real quick, which I know has a bright backlight. Um, so you guys can see that as well. HP 6. Let it spawn in. There we go. And we'll just leave uh, the undercover. That is just the takedown. That's not actually something trying to give you guys just a, a, a realistic option of what it's going to look like for you guys. We're going to take off that high beams. So it looks pretty good. Got that flashing light bar in the back. We turn the brights off, or the lights off actually. You can see what it looks like. So it's really up to preference. It's up to what you guys think and like. Um, so yeah, hopefully that guys helps you out. Uh, if you have any questions and you're in the Department of Law Enforcement, feel free to reach out to a staff member and ask. Um, if you are looking to join the community, feel free to join our fan server. That link is in the description as well. You can reach out to a staff member as well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed, learned, and uh, we will see you next video.